That's crazy, man. What else we got? We got uh, your boy right here, Nick Diaz, has a question. <laughs> what up, Theo? What up, Tom? It's your boy, Daniel Javier Fitz, and you in Arizona. I got to yeah. ask, I know Tom's new lifestyle probably doesn't allow much fast food, but McDonald's or Burger not King? McDonald's. Not Donald's? Hey, My daughter's is not Donald's. Gang, gang. Gang, gang, bro. It's not even a debate. Yeah, it's, McDonald's. It's McDonald's. Yeah. <laughs> what is Burger King doing? I mean, come on. They, they've they've really dropped the ball, man. Dude, you remember they used to have the little thing where they had the uh, pictures of like the handicapped kid wheels or whatever their characters used to be like twenty mm -mm. years ago or thirty years no. ago. They used to have a picture of a handicapped kid. Yeah, the McDonald's Kids Club and like all of their group like. Oh, McDonald. You thought you said Burger King? Oh no, this was a uh, Burger King Kids Club. Burger King And it King was like, Kids here's Club. Radar, you know, and it was like a tall, like, black guy with, like, uh, His name was glasses or something, you uh -huh. know? And here it was like, here's uh, Wheels, and it was like a handicapped ginger. No, I don't remember that at all. You know, that used to be their whole thing. It was like this kind of McDonald's Kids Club. There they are. And, uh, yeah, they had the handicapped ginger right there. Yeah, like Santino in the chair. Oh, definitely, very much. Those are the good old days, though. Do you like Burger King? You know what? I, I I didn't mind their dessert menu like in the probably early two thousands, but I don't like anything they have now. I never liked the Whopper. Yeah, no, Who I mean, ate it. I mean, dude, like you know, look if if you have no options, you're gonna you know what I mean? Like, so there's certain road trips where you're like, we gotta eat event like some point, and you pull off, and there's like one place, and so, a lot of times you just settle for whatever's fucking there, right? But I mean, if you have options, yeah. Come on, let me take McDonald's over that shit every time. Yeah, Burger King had that chicken Their sandwich. Their fries suck. That the chicken, sa the fried one, the yes. breaded one, it was good, right? It was so good. Yeah, the traditional chicken sandwich, I think, wasn't. Yeah, some of the other choices they've made have just been extremely downhill. The King that was like scaring people in their bedrooms and stuff was their that advertisement. Was fucking weird. That was such a bad the choice. The fuck is that? Man? Their ad people should be fucking <laughs> shot. <laughs> Unbelievable. Because even now, the handicapped ginger, the scary King. Even now, though, you imagine like imagine what Burger King's marketing budget is. It's yeah. got to be just astronomical. Billion dollars, I bet. Crazy money, and you can't find a fucking advertising company to get your shit straight. <laughs> like, look at what some of these companies do with advertising. It's amazing. Yeah. You know, like, they should fucking hire, like, comedians, somebody to, like, really, like, a, a good comic to, to get involved with them. But this bullshit? Hey, look at this. A drooling... This guy? It's a god. It's like a... It's Saw 5. It looks like a goddamn <laughs> horror yeah. film. It's terrifying, man. And the burger... Yeah, it's known that the burger, they paint the stripes on it. It's not even... At least just say, hey. They paint the stripes on that? <laughs> yeah, dude. They don't fucking cook that. <laughs> what grill do you see at a fucking <laughs> Burger King, dude? It's two sisters in the back fucking about to fist what's fight. Your, Have you what's, fucking your, been there? what's your opinion on if you're taking like the national big name burger people? Five guys, what a burger, uh, steak shack, in and out. Where do you, where do you land? Who oh, do you go Wendy's. With? Wendy's? Yeah. Over everybody? You too? Mm -hmm. I go in and out. I think it's like a different Yeah, I don't know. And you're yeah. you're I both like, Wendy's. Yeah. I like in and out because I love they have a lot of Latino employees. And that's what gets And that's you. my favorite. Yeah, because Latinos always are just such a hard working group. I really like that vibe, you know? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think they're gonna rule in and the out, world. The uh the training is obviously superior to every other place by far dude. the way they treat you talk to you even have people like you know sometimes you go in a fast food place you're like you're a fucking mess yeah. your whole life's a mess you just know it <laughs> and then in and out they're, they're like you go like what are you doing they're like oh, i'm gonna getting my engineering degree yeah and they're like like they just look like they have their shit together you yeah know? Yeah, right. I agree. They're do yeah, they're learning. We gotta be reading and doing the fryer. He'll actually be yeah. reading. Yeah, like yeah. Used to see on the TV shows, exactly. you know. Exactly. But they're that's they're they're primo, man. Yeah. I never thought even to bring Wendy's into the conversation. Really? Yeah. Wendy's is next level for me. Wendy's is very you too. unique. Really. Love Wendy's. Wow. Yeah. Look at Burger King, and the, yeah, the Whopper always looks like it fucking got in a domestic dispute. <laughs> yeah, it does. It does. Part of the reason I picked that question is because I wanted to hear if the McDonald's spon I wanted to hear your about your McDonald's sponsorship and whether or yeah. not that was real. Yeah, that was real. Yeah, yeah. So they sponsored us, took money away, and then came back and then made uh, 
Christina also like a, a paid endorser. Hmm. So yeah, that's cool. Yeah, it's very cool. So yeah, we're definitely a hardcore McDonald's family now. Yeah, 